Hello, internet. Hello, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what am I doing with my hands? Um, hi, hello, and welcome. Subscribe to this channel for more vape videos. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it. And don't forget to turn on the bell notification symbol so you don't miss a single upload. You can check the description box below for important links like where to find me outside of YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. You might want to follow me on social medias if you're not already because I do all of my extra vape stuff giveaways over on my social medias because you cannot give them away on here technically it's not allowed so if you get caught by YouTube say bye bye to your channel I'm not gonna risk it check out my social medias I also use Twitter every day to chat with you guys directly I love it and I use Instagram for Instagram story I'm addicted to it and I post my like everyday life happenings mostly on there every single day. So check those out and I also have a second YouTube channel where I do non-vape videos, vlogs a lot of the time and I do um, other hobbies and interests of mine, lots of baby stuff. So if you want to check out what else I do, you can check the link below and there's also a link to my Patreon account which is a vape related Patreon and I'm adding a new tier for the month of May. I'm going to be doing um, mods. You can get kits or mods no, probably just kits, an e-liquid sent to you monthly, depending on which tier you join. So check that out if you want. It's all in the goodie box below down here. So let's jump into the video, but also before we get into it, I did wanna let you guys know that I have heard of this company before, and when I first heard it, I was like, just, I just heard the name. And I was like, no, no thank you, <laughs> just, Nah. But upon further looking into it, it wasn't what it first seems like. It's definitely themed that way, but it's not like as bad as I was imagining it. So with that being said, also they're doing a huge giveaway. So listen up for that too. Um, we have Broke Dick, E-Liquid, their Magnum line, Magnum Extra Large Flavor. Yes, so I was like, ugh, broke thick, magnum. No, <laughs> um, but it's not like that. It's like broke dick, like broke, broke joke, you know, like uh, prepaid, payday, the first. They're themed like somebody who's broke. I don't necessarily like the name just because it is, I don't want to say the word dick on my channel, you know, but here we are and they're doing a huge giveaway. I guess they did a huge giveaway two years ago, like over a hundred thousand dollars of e-liquid given away. And this year they're doing a hundred, they're going to beat their record and do a hundred and one thousand dollars on their website. So that's brokedick.com slash giveaway and they will be giving away that stuff there. So if you want to get in on a hundred thousand and one dollar e-liquid giveaway, check it out, brokedick.com slash giveaway. So let's go into the flavor trying. We have three flavors here and they have more than that on their website. So we have the first on the side here, it says strawberries and cream. We have payday on the side here, it says adult milkshake. And we have prepaid on the side here, it says mixed berry blast. Made in the USA also. Their flavors are available in zero, three, and six for 120 ml bottles is all that they offer and they are 11.75 right now on the website. Right now as a filming, I'm looking at it right now. So the payday one is an adult milkshake, which is banana fosters, bourbon, butterscotch, twist of orange, cappuccino, whipped cream, toasted coconut. Who is calling me? Hello? Sorry about that. My husband is like, what can I feed Lucas? We're doing baby lead weaning, so. It's a little bit intimidating, but it's so worth it. Anyways, where was I? Twist of orange, cappuccino, whipped cream, toasted coconut. This sounds freaking delicious. The picture on their website looks freaking delicious, and I'm going to probably try that one last, just because it's the one that like, sounds really good. But also, this other one sounds good too. The first, creamy vanilla goodness, fresh strawberries, and cool whipped topping. So that's a strawberry milkshake. And prepaid is the berry blast, blueberries, raspberries, strawberries, watermelon, and a little magic. So cute. That's probably the one we'll try first. We'll go ahead and try prepaid first only because that's like the least exciting to me of the flavors. 
just based on my personal preference. And they do recommend that you cut like one millimeter to two millimeters off of the tips of these. It comes in the card because of pressure buildup. So I don't know if that was one or two milliliters, millimeters, but that's what we did. Ooh, mm, this smells good. Got some fresh cotton right here. So I'm almost getting like a blue raspberry vibe from this, which it does have blueberries and raspberries in it, so that makes sense. Maybe a little bit of strawberry and a little bit of watermelon, but mostly overpowered by that raspberry and undertone of blueberry. And it kind of gives me like berry lemonade vibes without the lemonade, just saying that it kind of gives me like a drink, like it kind of tastes like a summertime drink. You know, it's actually pretty freaking good. Yum. I mean, pfft. I was like going into it not expecting much, but that's a pretty yummy flavor. And I feel like berry mixtures freaking go at this flavor. It makes me kind of more excited for the other ones. So what, what's the next one we're gonna try? The next one we're gonna try is the first. And I think I already, did I already cut this one? I'm not sure. Mm, oh my goodness. This one does smell like a strawberry milkshake. I will say I am picky when it comes to strawberry flavors because I've had a million of them because strawberry is my ultimate favorite flute. Flute. I always do that. My ultimate favorite fruit flavor to vape. So to me, this almost has like a dried strawberry flavor to it. It is getting the creamy whipped cream part of the milkshake, like the frothy, milky, yummy thickness. But the flavor description on their website claims fresh, fresh. I cannot talk today. Fresh strawberries, not not what I'm tasting. I'm getting like a like a, either like a dried strawberry or like a strawberry drizzle, like the strawberry topping syrup stuff that people use sometimes. Maybe like a hint of fresh strawberry, but it's really just an overpowering, but not in a bad way, thick, creamy. Um, strawberry flavored. So they're really getting the essence of the milkshake um, texture, if that's, I mean like, honestly, it's, it, it vapes and it tastes thick, like a milkshake, frothy and thick. Um, but yeah, not like, not really screaming fresh strawberries to me, but that's okay. My flavor, my taste buds, that's what my taste buds say, your taste buds may be like, saying something else, so, you know? Taste is subjective. Not a bad flavor, just, not super fresh strawberries, but I, you know, when you drink a milkshake, it's not like you're getting fresh strawberries in there. They're blended up with the milkshake ingredients. And last but not least, the one I'm actually really excited to try. This is kind of like a little darker than the rest of their, the other flavors I have. Ooh, ooh, squirted. Mmm, you can smell the bananas, the bourbon, and the butterscotch. BBB. This is not, why is this lighting? Not that great. <coughs> Hold up. Wait a minute. Okay, that's why. I was like, oh, sh we can't vape this one. Holy crap, what's going on? What's wrong? Why is it not good? So these two, is this not the right lid? these two that I just tried, the first and prepaid. They're both zero milligrams, okay? The 
this one. Payday. The Banana Foster's Bourbon Butterscotch Twist of Orange Cappuccino Whipped Cream Toasted Coconut. You see that? Do you see it? It's six. Oh my gosh. I can like barely get by on three when I have e-liquid that's sent to me um, a long time ago that I haven't got to and it's still when I used to vape three, which is fine. That's my, you know, my fault. Not fault. I'm not at fault, but like that's how long my cue is that some of the e-liquid I still have has three milligrams, even though I've moved on to zero and I don't use any nicotine. Um, but I have not vaped six in a million years. It is an honest mistake probably by whoever packaged my, um, my package. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like Nick buzzed already because I was not anticipating a six Nick and that was very harsh for me as someone who doesn't vape nicotine. Um, I was caught off guard, so I didn't really, wasn't able to, to, to taste it. Um, but I'm gonna try one more time because I'm already like feeling the nicotine buzz. That is so sad, but so true. I'm just human and I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Um, I'm working a lot harder on being as like, not blunt, I don't wanna sound like a bitch, but I'm just trying to be as honest as possible. So um, I'm gonna give this one more shot and try to tell you what I, taste because this was the flavor that I was like super excited for. <laughs> I'm so Nick buzzed you guys. This is sad. Um, so I'm definitely getting See, I just, it's really hard for me to focus on the flavor when I'm trying not to cough up a lung because I haven't vaped six milligrams in probably like at least two years, maybe even longer than that. Um, definitely taste the banana, like you can't mistake that. And you know, maybe some butterscotch in there, but I mean, that nicotine gets me. Um, so <laughs> I don't know what else to say because I, I can't vape it enough to like describe what I'm tasting, which is okay, you know, honest, honest mistake. Somebody, it's okay. Broke dick if you're watching, and I know you probably are. Do not fire whoever sent me the wrong nicotine level. It is an honest mistake. I don't want them to get in trouble either. See, this is like another thing why I'm like, always like, gosh, I don't, like I hate do be negative in my videos is because I don't want someone to be in trouble because I know somewhere somebody is like, no, you sent her the wrong e-liquid or like, you know, whatevs. It's no big deal. The other two flavors were good. The berry one, honestly, because the, the payday was out of my personal preference for nicotine, but honestly, the berry one was the best. And that was the one that I was like, not that interested in, but it was the best one out of these three. So yeah, check out their other flavors. They're super cheap, 11 75 for 120 mils. Like, that's cheaper than my e-liquid. So comment down below what you think of these e-liquids. Um, check out their website. Check out brokedick.com slash giveaway to enter their huge giveaway for e-liquid. And that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Fight for your right to vape. I'll see you guys in the next video. So as always, I'm Tia, and thank you so much for watching.